Julia and welcome back to my channel and welcome back to another video. So for today's video I'm actually switching up a little bit and I'm going to be doing a haul. I haven't done hauls in so freaking long. So I went shopping the other day to Blue Water. I did vlog it. I have a vlogging channel if you guys didn't already know I'll leave it on screen and link down below. So you guys go check out that video and subscribe. I basically asked you guys over my Instagram if you want to see a haul and it was like 96% yes so here we are and I'm going to show you guys everything that I got. This will also be a try on haul because I just feel like it's a lot more helpful for you guys to see obviously how things fit if you want to go get it online and I will obviously leave a link to everything that I can in the description box below as I always do in all my videos. I feel like we should just get into it because I have a lot of stuff. I went to Primark, New Look, Tory Secret, River Island and I just got a lot of things. I don't think I said that it's actually going to be like a collective haul and not just like a one shop wonder kind of thing. So yeah, let's just get into it. Actually, I forgot something. It's over there. So I think I'm actually going to start off with Victoria's Secrets because this is pretty, you know, it's nothing that special. I didn't actually get any underwear, surprisingly, I know. I'm not sure if it's just me, but I wanted some like holiday scents. So I decided to go in and I grabbed two of their like i guess this is like a new range i got tropic splash and peony blush and then these were two for 22 pounds and they actually had two of these i absolutely love heavenly from victoria's secret i actually prefer the body mist than the actual like perfume and these were like a five at each instead of 14 pounds so i mean that was an absolute bargs so good they're like really like floral and cute i really like this one i think that's my fave i think i'm then gonna go on to primark because there is a lot of stuff in here you know it's um a big bag so first things first we have a hat this was four pounds and i've never actually owned a hat like this before but i just thought when we go on holiday Maybe I might need to, you know, have a little bit of shade. I really like it because it has, like, the black detailing. I actually picked up two tops. These were in, like, the pyjama section. I'm not sure if they're meant for pyjamas, but I'm going to wear them out anyway. So I picked these up. They're, like, really lovely ribbed kind of like crop tops and they actually have like a built-in bra to them which is so perfect I don't know if you guys can see honestly it's like a proper bra so maybe it is meant to be for pajamas I don't really know but I thought they were really cute they also have adjustable straps which is amazing and I also got one in a khaki greenish kind of color and again it's literally exactly the same I got them both in extra smalls I find Primark sizes really weird so I've got on the green ribbed top I don't really know what to call it like it is a crop top but it's also a bra as i said i got this in an extra small and this is just what the back looks like it's so honestly i love this so freaking much i'm gonna wear this so much in the summer and then we have it in the pink which i love just as much guys these are honestly so comfortable i don't know if they're meant to be for bed but i mean i don't think you can tell the difference if they are or if they're not i probably could have gone a size smaller because it is a little bit baggy but i wanted it more for the length because i don't really like this section of me honestly i love these so freaking much <laughs> i actually originally picked up like a mid-length dress you guys will see it in my vlog but i got it home and tried it on in front of my boyfriend i was like actually no like you know sometimes you just buy things that is like totally out of your comfort zone i got home and was like yeah i'm not actually gonna wear this so i took that back and i also took back like an arm band thing obviously you used to run with like your phone and um got it home realized it didn't actually fit my phone so yeah, that was not great. I then picked up some PS Bare Face Beauty Argan Oil Facial Cleansing Wipes for dry skin. And I actually can't use these. I used one and my face has literally like gone up in a rash. I've got a rash underneath my eye, above my lip and on my neck here. They're only a pound for two, but I can't actually use them. So if anyone wants them, let me know. And then moving on to accessories, I picked up a pack of scrunchies. I have been loving scrunchies. I think Primark scrunchies are amazing and it's £2 for three, so can you really complain? So I've got a plain black one, a lovely green colour. I love the colour green. And then obviously like an orangey patterned one, which is lovely. And then the last little accessory from Primark was actually a headband. This was £2 as well. I actually want to try and get off the tag so I can actually put it on properly for you guys. I've been at absolutely loving hairbands this is on the photo she wears it like here but um do we really think we'll be wearing it there but i just think they're so super cute and it makes you look like you've made an effort with your hair even though like you really haven't you're just you know 
shoving a hairband in. It really brings me back to when I was younger because I used to live and die in hairbands like this. Like, I used to have a box, like, full of, like, these hairbands and, like, those little, like, clip flowers. I actually really like it. I think it's cute. It has a little pop of colour. And then the final things from Primark. Um... <sighs> Did I need them? No. Did I want them? Yes. And they are little, like... Oh my god, my ring light's reflecting into it. It's called Tropical Inflatable Pong. It's basically like beer pong, but you can like play it in the pool. So, yeah. <laughs> this is one of those purchases that I just saw and I was like, yeah, actually I want it. So I'm going to get it. This was £5 and inside here you get six plastic cups, two ping pong balls and one inflatable pool pong. Like actual inflatable thing so that's why I bought two you can obviously just play with one but I thought it would make it more fun with two so I'm very excited to take these on holiday I actually haven't even opened them yet so you get your little cups and they have little passion fruits on so cute and then obviously you get two ping pong balls and obviously like the actual thing I kind of want to blow it up to show you guys I'm gonna do it oh my god I'm gonna be here for hours is it even like inflating anywhere I wasn't pinching it, I'm such an idiot. Right, that'll do. Oh my god, it's escaping. The air is escaping. Quick. Why am I actually giving you guys a tutorial on how to do this? Like, I'm sure everyone knows. And look at that. You can just, like, shove it in the pool, have a bit of fun with your friends and, like... Love that. Wow, that was a waste of time. I'm now going to move on to H&M. I only got a couple of bits from there, but, you know, it's all worth showing. So I got another hairband, and I want to get these tags off again. Where did I put those scissors? So this was £4.99, and Primark actually did sell the exact things as this for, obviously, a fraction of the cost. But I had already bought this one, and this one's an actual plastic hairband. And again, I mean, it looks like I've put a lot of thought into my hair, and I haven't. I actually might keep this one on for the rest of the video, because it, like, matches i then bought a bath mat fun as you guys know obviously i'm moving to paris and i've been needing a bath mat for ages this one was from h&m home and it was only 3.99 quickly detouring from all like the clothes and stuff i went into super drug and picked up a few bits so the first thing i picked up was the maybelline tattoo brow i wanted to start you know doing my eyebrows properly so i decided to finally pick it up i then also picked up the revolution glow revolution prime set glow illuminating face and body spray this is basically like the iconic one and it it just looks so freaking cool so you shake it it sounds like spray paint and like it just looks beautiful and i got the gold one they did have a darker shade but i decided not to get that one and then i went to boots and boots are actually stuck in fenty beauty now which is crazy i've always wanted to get hold of some of the stuff and i just couldn't be bothered to order it online and i couldn't be bothered to obviously trek up to london for a bit of makeup i actually picked up the fenty beauty gloss bomb lip gloss stuff in Fenty Glow. So this was £16. I absolutely love the packaging. I think it's so cute. And I love the applicator, like how big it is. I'm wearing it currently over a lipstick. And I mean, £16 is quite pricey for a lip gloss, I feel. I don't know. I do like it, don't get me wrong, but there's probably cheaper alternatives out there. Moving on to new look. I never, ever ever shop in new look i used to when i was in like year seven and eight but ever since then i haven't really and i went in with evie and i was like you know what i might find something i like and i did it's not actually part of new look like the actual section it's like the ax paris that they stock in there this play suit was 22 pounds i believe and i got it in a size eight and this is basically what it looks like you guys will obviously see better in the channel clip i've just noticed we've got a loose thread that's not great as i said earlier i love the color green i feel like it really like complements my hair with a tan it's great and it basically has like green banana leaves is it i think it is banana leaves i absolutely love this play suit i think it's just so perfect for holiday and it's like the perfect length as well like it literally does not show like off your bum or anything and also i really like it because the neck is actually like adjustable so obviously if you want it like a lot in you can have it a lot in if you want it a little bit out or really out then you know you can kind of style it to how you want what i will say with this is the first eight that i tried on they for some reason made like the armholes really big so it was really baggy so if you do get this make sure you just like check out like the armhole sizes because they're obviously not the same i actually really like this headband with it as well like imagine on holiday like a pair of little like sandals or hair trainers oh my god my eyes on mcqueen's to like kind of like cash it up i don't know i just feel like do you know like when you wear something and you're like this is so holiday 
that's how I feel right now. And then finally moving on to River Island. I haven't found anything in River Island for so long. I'd go in there and I'd walk out empty handed and River Island used to be like my go-to shop and I just couldn't find anything. But then I went in and found so much stuff that I loved. You know what, these things are cute and everything that I've bought isn't just like a now piece. Like I'm gonna wanna wear it for, you know, the foreseeable future, I hope. And this is actually something that when I first saw it, I was like, do you know what it's really cute but it's really out of my comfort zone like i don't think that i would be able to pull this off wow we're really tangled here but then i tried it on and i was like you know what? it's actually really cute and i had to actually get it in the size six which is crazy because i'm definitely not a size six but just across the shoulders let me show you guys it was a little bit baggy so this was 38 pounds which i think is a little bit pricey i mean everything in river island is a little bit pricey let's be real it's basically like a bar dough this is massive as well like this is a six so keep in mind if you're going to get this to definitely size down it's really hard to show you guys obviously i can show you better on the try on clip and it basically has like tortoiseshell buttons and this just gives me massive like beachy vibes i just feel like i will like this when i'm older as well so obviously i'm gonna wear it now like it goes out the same but obviously as you get older you know you need to start you know changing your style i'm only 20 i don't know why i'm talking like i'm like 60 but yeah i really like this and i'm sure you can get things like this in primark or somewhere i was looking at it like i could probably get this in primark but it's such good quality it's like a cheesecloth material which i love in the summer it also comes with a little like slip underneath so obviously you're not you know flashing the world and i'm gonna wear this you know when we go on a holiday around the beach and be like a beach babe oh my god this with that beach hat is gonna be you know a vibe guys i actually can't tell you how happy i am that i decided to buy this dress it's kind of probably not going to show up very well because obviously i've got a white background and i'm so happy that i decided to size down in it because it's actually like dragging on the floor bear in mind i'm like five foot five so this is like the perfect length for me i actually want to try this on with my hat though so let's get rid of this hairband oh god i just stood on the dress i'm not used to wearing long dresses i never wear a long dress like i don't think i've ever worn a long dress so this is the kind of look that i was going for so like proper like beachy but as i was saying i friggin love this outfit so much and there's definitely going to be some insta pics of me on the beach you know living my best life <laughs> moving on to the most gorgeous pair of shorts i'm actually shorts mad i don't know why so basically they are like a monochrome what kind of pattern even is it it's just like squiggles i think and i got these in a size eight and they were 24 pounds i love shorts like this like they have little frills at the bottom and on the side i just think these are super cute with like a plain either black bandeau top or a white one when i saw them i was like Ugh. like i think it kind of took my breath away i was like these are so freaking cute and i'm such like a black and white kind of gal i just put it on with this top because i already had it on but i actually don't think that they look bad at all with like a pop of color but this is what the shorts fit like they are really like airy and lovely this is them from the back i'm not showing you guys my bum nope it's perfectly covered guys i love these shorts so so much i know that obviously they make your hips look like a little bit bigger because they do obviously have like extra material but i think it's absolutely fine if you wear like a little crop top or something with them but they're just such good quality and yeah i love them so much and the final thing is probably my favorite purchase and literally evie will tell you when i saw this i was like oh no i love it and i knew it was going to be expensive and i was like <sighs> I'm just gonna have to get it because it is stunning. So I picked up this denim jacket in baby friggin' pink. You guys know I love pastel colors. I don't know why, but pastel anything, I'm like, oh, I love it so much. And it's like cropped as well. And it has rose gold buttons. And also on the back, it has like a row of buttons. Like, please tell me this is just not the cutest thing that you've ever seen in your life. So I picked this up in a size small and it was 45. And I was like, it is really cute though. Like, obviously you can get denim jackets for a lot cheaper, but i'm a sucker for pastel especially pastel pink i'm just gonna shove this on with this outfit i know it doesn't go at all and we've got you know a lot of shades of pink going on but i just want to show you guys obviously the fit but i just think this jacket is so cute i probably if they had an extra small might have got the extra small because it is oversized cropped if that makes sense but i just think this is so so cute it's like the perfect croppedness and i just think it's so lovely and then obviously the back with all the buttons down, I mean, come on guys. 
like how cute is this you guys definitely need to go get it if you love denim jacket and pastel pink I can't wait to wear this so that is the end of the haul and i hope you all did enjoy it if you did don't forget to leave it a massive thumbs up and comment down below what you thought obviously i know it's a little bit different from what i normally do on my channel don't worry i'm not like changing my channel but i would really enjoy to like do more hauls maybe like one a month or something i don't know let me know if you guys actually did enjoy it if not then um yeah <laughs> and obviously if you aren't already make sure you subscribe to my channel and don't forget to subscribe to my vlogging channel follow me on instagram you know all that good stuff i will see you guys very soon with a new video bye <laughs>